you're going to need an eye pen. Any color of clay for your base. Translucent clay. Silver clay. And a lot of different colors for the gumballs. Red, orange, green, yellow, blue. And you're also going to need some baby wipes to whip off your hands in between colors so your colors don't mix. So get a piece of green clay and roll it into an oval shape but make it thinner at the top so it looks like that. And then shape it so it looks like that and make it how you want. Then get three balls of clay and you're going to get one big one, one medium, and one small one. And then what you're going to do is rip up your hands. And that's what it looks like after I ripped off my hands. And set those green balls aside, by the way. So now what you're going to do is get some translucent clay. And roll it into a ball. And see if it fits your gumball machine. I had to add more. And now you're going to get a blade or an eye pin. And made it make it uneven on both of the on both of the things so it sticks together and then what you're going to want to do is connect them so now what you're going to want to do is flatten out your green balls just a little bit That's what they look like when they're all flattened. So now you're going to wipe up your hands again. And get all of your gumball machine, I mean all of your gumball colors. And roll out a lot of gumballs. And I have to use a lot more than this. And then what you're going to want to do is stick on some gumballs. Put as many or as little as you want. And I have to move those gumballs down. And then what you're going to want to do is make it uneven again for the top. Get the biggest piece and put it on top of your gumball machine. So it fits. Then get the smaller piece and put that on top and the smallest piece and put that on top. And I thought it was a little bit too, like, up high, so I just kind of fixed the circle, circles. And then you're going to get some silver clay. I don't know why I rolled it out, but you're going to make it into, like, a, um, a circle shape, but cut off the, the bottom. So it looks like that. Kind of like a little door to a house. Kind of. Not really. <laughs> and get another piece if you want. Put on the bottom. But I didn't do that. I just used that piece for the lever part that you push to get out the gumballs. Get a blade or something and make a little indentation. And then you're going to get some of the color of clay that you used for the base, like for the gumball machine, and again I use green, and you're going to wrap it around, and 
and trim it off. And yes, you are going to need a blade. I did not mention that in the beginning. Smooth it out. Then get your eye pen. You can put bacon bond on it, but then you're going to just stick it into your gumball machine. So that is how you make a polymer plate gumball machine. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'm having a spring craft give giveaway going on. Go check it out. It ends at April 30th. So in three days, go check it out. So yeah. And by the way, if you want, you can glaze your gumball machine. But I decided not to. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And have a nice day.